And here we go with Celest <clears throat> said, but postquam conjunction after Bello, Bello Confectus over the war complete. And afterwards, um, when Maori's Nostra, when our ancestors had had a consultamist, when they'd uh, had a discussion or a little council concerning the Rhodians, Naquis, lest anyone should do something, we have the genitive divitarum of riches, magus quam, more than inuria. So here's the causa. Lest anyone would decorate, would, uh, would say this, that for the sake of riches, divitarum, more than of any injury or insults, um, they had inceptum bellum. They had started the war. So what they've done is they've had a bit of a discussion and they didn't want to seem like they'd started the war just for riches. That they uh, demisray, they sent them away, the Eos would be these Rhodian people, um, impunitos, unpunished. So they've had a war, they didn't want people to think that they were just doing it for money, so they sent them away unpunished. So if we have more information, it says the Elder Cato in a speech in 167, fragments which are preserved, persuaded the Romans not to declare war on the Rhodians. The Rhodians, however, were stripped of their possessions on the mainland of Southwest Asia Minor, and their trade was crippled. Okay, so part six, Etam. So likewise, Bellis Punicus Omnibus in all the Punic Wars, of which there were three, uh, when Sapi went off from the Carthaginians, um, Ethernet, so we have correlatives both in peace and through, looks like uh, many injudious, many treases, uh, truces. They had forgissant, they had done, uh, actually through their truces, they had done multi nefaria facanoras, many uh, nefarious crimes, or, and never, numquam, uh, themselves the Romans. Per occasionem tali fecere, they had not uh, fecere, they had not done s when things when they had such occasions, basically. So magus quid se dignum fere, so more uh, f should be for, or was worthy for themselves, quid just means something that was uh, worthy for himself, uh, magus quam, more than uh, quid what was able to, uh, fury, be done ure, uh, rightly, in with the accusative uh, towards them. Okay, they querebanted, they uh, searched for what would seem to dignify themselves or be worthy of themselves rather than what they could actually, all the possibilities they could have done legally. Hoc item, so this likewise, providendum est, must be seen, dative by you, um, vocative, patres conscripti, the uh, senators, the conscript fathers, that nay, lest um, valiant should be more stronger, that's the subjunctive, uh, plus it means more, and a plus vos means against you, that p lentuli, the genitive, basically is skelos, this crime of lentulus and of the rest should not be more, have more power or more influence among you uh, than uh, the dignitas vostra, than your own dignity, and you, uh, nor, I have more of anger of yours uh, than your pharma consultatus. So he's worried about their infamy or their repute or their uh, good name as well there. So he's just advising them um, about the strength of the crime again and weighing this up against uh, their dignity and their anger and uh, what will be recorded about them. Nam C. Uh, for if a poena digna, a worthy punishment, pro factus, for the facts or their deeds, eorum of them, is reparated, is found, so we find a worthy punishment uh, to their deeds, ad probo, I approve, I approvo of taking a new concilium or uh, a different form of our plan to our, what you would do normally. Uh, sin, so... If not, or, um, or if the magnitude of their scholars, of their crime, exuperates, uh, goes beyond the ingenium omnum, the, where you get uh, ingenuity and the genius and etc. It's just your natural characteristics. So, but if the magnitude of their crime goes beyond all normal people's uh, characteristics, 
utendum essentio, essentio. So I think we should use his. Utor takes the ablative, so we should use these. Uh, Qua, so this is is used for male, female, and neuter. We know it's uh, female here. Uh, which the legibuses, which are the laws comparata, so the um, laws that their ancestors had procured or created that should be used if they really think that this crime goes beyond all. Pleriqui, so it means most eorum, most of those, qui, who, ante, me, before me, have uh, dixerunted, have, have stated their sentiments, their uh, viewpoints or their opinions. Uh, composite, at qui magnifique, anyways, the verb miserato, they've deplored or spoken in a miserable way about this castle, which is like the doom or the what has affected the Republic, uh, well composed and in a magnificent way, so uh, gracefully or something you might want to say. Um, the casem has a like a bad uh, thing attached to it, so it's, you know, it's, uh, bad things happened to the Republic, but um, people who spoke before him um, spoke well prepared and uh, organised. Mm. Quay, in which was the savitia belli, the savageness of the war, which were, which accurate to the Devictus, what had happened to the defeated people, they enumerated, they enumerated or counted the raptire virgins, the raped maidens, the puros, the boys taken away, the libros, the children, um, divelli, plucked away or distanced or taken away from the complexu of their parents, the embrace of their parents, the matres uh, familiarum, what they've suffered, uh, conlubicent to the will of the victors, uh, the fauna, which are the shrines and the domoses, or the houses they are despoiled or uh, ravaged for um, booty, etc. Arcadium's uh, the slaughter, there was incendia which happened, fires that happened, and finally, or in short, there was the arms and the cadavers and the cruel, which is the blood and the luctor, the grief. Um, all this, Omnia, was complerai, uh, was lamented or something like that. 10. Said, but, per Dios Immortalis, through the immortal gods, quo, to where did illa oratia, this, uh, these orations or these uh, defences, what were they pertaining to? What was the end result? Uh, Compleri also, it's an alternate spelling of Compleri, so that filled up all their talk. What was the end result? Where was all this oration going? And Utai Vos, uh, whether it should be uh, that you, that this should make you, Fakarets, making, would this make you infestos, uh, would it make you hostile to the conuration, to the conspiracy? Uh, obviously, or without doubt, quam him who, uh, res tanta in tam atrox, uh, such a matter and uh, so atrocious a matter, or fierce a matter, so quam, who would non permove it? Who would not be moved by such a matter and so atrocious um, that him, Eum, akendet, so he'd be burning from an oration or uh, some fierce talking would get him moved, I'm guessing? Non it est. It's not so. Uh, Nequi and neither cui quem to anyone, uh, mortalim, of the mortals, so neither is anyone who's mortal uh, would videntor, would see their own injustices or their own wrongdoings as a small thing, a pave, uh, multi. Many people, habore, they um, consider these gravious, more, f more serious uh, than equal, than fair. Said, but, alia alias, licentia. So others uh, have licentia, have got more license alias than others, uh, patres conscripti, conscript fathers. Some people have more license than others. How far are we going today? Down to here. Qui demiso in obscuro vitem habent. So something like those who, qui, who habent, they spend their lives, although they have a life, uh, demiso, spent in obscure situations. Sequid, if there's something, uh, delinquent, if they've become delinquents, basically, if they've done some delinquency from iracundia by being very angry, uh, Poor Kai Scan, very few people 
will uh, ski on this. A few people will, will know about it because uh, this guy is living in obscurity. Farmer and Fortuna Eorum. So the fame and the fortune of these people are pares, uh, the same. They have a lowly life, lowly fame, lowly fortune. Uh, qui, he who um, is praeditae, he is endowed with or given, uh, takes the ablative, uh, a magno imperium, who has who's been endowed with great power, um, they argunt their atim, atatim. They live out their lives or their age in excelso, in a very high place. Um, the factor, eorum, the deeds of them, uh, cuncti mortales, all the mortals are uh, novre. So all people uh, know the deeds of those who have been gifted with great power and are living a very high life, or important life. They're known by everyone. So I've set up a daily dictionary word of praeditos. Praedito is the plural male. Someone who's endowed, gifted, provided with, possessed of something, construed with the ablative, post-Augustian, of a deity, construed with the dative. Someone who's presiding over things. Praeditos. Okay. Um, so, ita in maxima. So, thus, in maxima fortuna, so in a great fortune, uh, minuma licentius. There should be the least licentiousness or the least um, laxness, really, in their, their life. If you've got a great fortuna, everyone's looking at you. You shouldn't have too much uh, freedom. You should be setting a good example. Uh, neque studere, neque odissei. So you shouldn't be too studious for something, nor should you odisseo, which is hating, uh, said, but their decet, taking the infinity, there ought to be minimi irasco, least amount of anger in their judgments and uh, the roles they play in society, you might want to say. 14. Que, uh, the things which are put alias, amongst others, is dicatord, called irant, iracundia, it's called anger or wrath, uh, ea, this thing in the imperio, into someone with uh, power, imperium, is a pelotor called uh, superbia, which is arrogance or proudness, and crudalitas, which is cruelty. Equidem ego. Hmm. Uh, ego means the first person. Equidem usually refers to the first person as well. So you might want to say, I for my part, or me uh, concerning myself, or well, I, uh, thus existemu. I, I think thus, sick. Uh, Senators again, partres conscripte, vocative. All cruciatos, all sort of crucifications, all tortures. Um, he's existemoing. He thinks that all the tortures are minores, quam, minor than the facinora illorum to be. Uh, so he thinks any type of torture you give these people will be less than what the, the crime of these people deserves. Almost done. Said pleroque mortals, but most men are mimineering, uh, thinking about their post dreamer, the things that they've just done in the past. Um, and in hominus impious, uh, these are the impious men, they are obliti, plural, they are forgetful of their scelerises, of their crimes, and de pone, considering their punishments, they disarrant, which you get elegance and. Um, Things like that usually means to speak rather eloquently. Um, but C, Eo Paula, if this is just a little bit uh, severe, that's a comparative. So basically, from this bit, it looks like he wants them to be punished because uh, they've done such a bad crime. But uh, most mortals, this is like the third time he's called people mortals in this, they just think about what they've recently done and the impious men, they are forgetful of their crimes. So, um,. If you want to be a little bit more severe than normal, then obviously they won't be able to be obliter, they won't be forgetful of the punishment if they're actually given a, a severe punishment.